Welcome back, everyone. Today I'm going to remake Ultra View of a Dry C M1907. Okay. But before we begin, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification if you want to see more video. Let's read a little bit information about this uh, pistol here. So it was designed by uh, Louis Smicer. I'm gonna I'm gonna Google it first. Please wait. Okay. So the designer name is this. Louis Schmeisser. Okay. It was designed by that guy, and designed from 1905 to 1906, and manufactured by this company. Rheinische Metallwaren und Maschinenfabrik AG. Okay, so that's the name of the company, and it was produced by from 1907 to 1915. It fires 762 by not 762 765 by 17 7.65 millimeter by 17 millimeter semi rain Browning. Okay, or 32 ACP. So let's continue. Okay, as you can see here, this is how it works. Okay, right grip remove, left grip remove, side plate, frame, barrel extension. Maybe let's see the reloading. Of course, since it, it was European, they have this magazine catch down here, which is uh, at the magazine well. Okay, so let's reload. I just press this magazine catch, not releasing the magazine okay, out, the magazine in. Okay, just simple as that. Now let's fire it. So it was striker fire, okay. Yeah, it's a striker fire firing. So when you fire, you just pull the trigger. The trigger bar here gonna push the sear. Okay. Like that. Trigger, trigger bar, and the uh, sear here. You push, you pull the trigger. The sear go back here and pushing the firing pin. Not, not actually pushing the firing pin. Just disengage the firing pin, allowing the firing pin to strike the primer of the bullet here. Like that okay. When that happened. The blowback will push the push the slide back. Okay, like this. And there is ejector here that will push the empty casing out to the right. So we'll fire right here. Injection. You run into the chamber. Slide in. Everything is locked in position. Okay, so one more time. Okay. And also you can see here this connector here gonna push the trigger bar up when you fire. Slide go back. And the slide will push this connector into tilt and rotate and push the trigger bar up. Like that. Now the sear is free to capture again the firing the firing pin, like right here. As you can see. When you fire, it will release the slide go back. 
slide go back, pushing the trigger bar up, allowing the ser to capture the firing pin, like right here. Like right that, like that, okay. Trigger is being released, allowing it to reset, the trigger bar to reset. Now it's ready for firing the next round. As you can see, there's a bolt head here. Okay. So yeah, as you can see, this is the dry C, dry C, dry C. I call it dry C, dry C, dry C. Okay, dry C, whatever the name is. Let's let's Google how how to spell it. Is it in English? Dry C. Dry C. Okay, so it's dry C, not dry C. Okay, dry C. M nineteen O seven. Okay. So let's see the safety here. I think it's very simple safety. So when safety off, the sear can move down like this. Like this. Okay. So that's safety off. Now safety on. The sear will not move at all, keeping it in place. So, like that. Okay. But wait, 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 wait. Let's see what type of round is fire. Okay, there's no type of round here. There is a serial number here. So I guess that's it. Uh, there is nothing much here. It's just trace uh, M1907. If you want to learn about the history, you can watch uh, uh, Ken McCullen video from uh, Forgotten Weapon. You probably have one of this. So yeah, thank you for watching. I will see you in a few days with new video and need more uh, Valorant short for other watcher who enjoy my other video game review but if you here just to watch a uh, walk video WOG video World of Gun video you can you can uh, save the, the the playlist and you can just watch it I'll check it every week to see a new video. Okay. So, yeah, thank you for watching. I will see you in a few days. Bye bye. And don't forget to like, subscribe, become a member if you're interested. Bye bye.